brings you to this particular television show? Because obviously you you have big opportunities these days, it would seem. So yeah. What brought you to Ben and Kate? Um, it was a, a combination of a lot of things, I guess. I had worked with Jake Kasdan, who um, directed the pilot and also serves as an executive producer on the show. And um, I adore him and, and love working with him. And so uh, the opportunity to do that again was exciting to me. Um, and also the material right. was really um, special. I thought it was really well written. and. I loved the character itself, you know, Ben, it was something that felt kind of within my grasp in the sense that it wasn't so far from who I am, and so it felt like, uh oh, that would be really fun to kind of take that and, you know, amp it up a little bit. Uh, so that was really exciting, and, and, and also like the size of the role, to be a lead in a show, and you know, yeah. I'm, I, I often you know, before this had played like the the super model-y hot guys buddy, you know, <laughs> <laughs> like the fourth roommate or, you know, the neighbor friend. So it was nice, you know, to have a chance to, to be the guy for once um, and to take on that responsibility. And, uh, you know, I, I hadn't gotten the opportunity to really ever do that, so that was super appealing to me. So That's cool. it was kind of a combination, you know, the the, the part, the writing, the, the people involved, you know, Dana Fox, who created the show, is fantastic. Um, I, 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 you know, very much was excited by all of it. That's cool. Yeah. Well, I can't help but wonder, though, I mean, because of your Oscar, has that opened other doors? I mean, I realize yeah. it's a writing Oscar, but that's huge. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, you know, I don't know if it's opened other doors acting-wise, right. um, but certainly I think it helped probably raise my profile, I, you know, whatever that means. <laughs> my star meter went up or something, <laughs> um, which I still have no idea what that means. Uh, but um, it has enabled, you know, uh, Jim and I, Jim Rash, my writing partner, yeah. to do, you know, more of the things that we've wanted to do. You know, we, we wrote a script called The Way Way Back um, that was the um, the thing that sort of got us the job for The Descendants. And it was just been a script that we very close to and, you know, um, very personal. And we've been trying to get it made for seven years. And I think because of the success of The Descendants, um, we were able to sort of get some needed momentum for it. And right. we're able to direct it ourselves this past summer and assemble a great cast. And, you know, I, I think the momentum from, you know, the Descendants certainly had a lot to do with that. So, you know, I, we've been sort of choosing to go and take advantage in a creative way, you know, sort of more so than maybe a financial way. So, uh, which, you know, is, you know, not helping my rent, but it's <laughs> fulfilling me creatively, so. Well, creatively, do you, do you get to say much about what's happening with Ben throughout the series, or is it pretty much laid down for you and it's perfect the way it is? It's kind of laid down for me, and yeah. and I, I love and trust Dana and the right. writers quite a bit that I, I, I just sort of go with the flow on it, because I think that Dana's got such a clear vision for what she wants it to be, and I trust her implicitly, and I, and I love the material, so I never feel like oh, what did I get myself into, or oh, this is going down a path I don't think it should, or I fully embrace it. And it's nice to just kind of be an actor on the show and to just focus on that and to be excited to read a script every week is, you know, it's really fun. That's cool. Yeah, so it's really cool. What do you, what's your favorite part of Ben? Um, he's he's I, zany, to say the least. Yeah, I mean, I think his energy. I think I think his excitement about his endeavors, you know, whether, um, however sort of smart or crazy as they might, you know, <laughs> seem, I think he's, he's, he is a smart guy and he has, he has bright ideas. He just can't focus those things. But I, I like his 
you know, his sort of go for it attitude, you know, it's, it, that's admirable, you know, to sort of be that excited by things, regardless of whether they work or not, you know. <laughs> What's it like working with the cast? It's a pretty cool group of people. It is. It's, I feel very fortunate because it's, they are not only very talented actors, but also very good people. So it wow. makes for a really fun, supportive environment. Um, you know, we laugh a ton and, and uh, I am jealous of what they can do, you know, and the things that I can't do. And, <laughs> um, and I just love going to work every day and kind of improvising with them on occasion and, and you know, um, everybody can, you know, hold their own Im Im immaculately, you know, like in terms of comedy chops and, mm -hmm. and so you, you don't often get that, uh, you know, on shows. I think I, you certainly don't always get like an ensemble where everybody is very strong mm -hmm. and, you know, a sort of a heavyweight and, and, um, that's, so I, I sort of pray the show continues to, you know, do well and continues on because it's, it's fun to be able to be a part of that. Where would you like to see Ben go? Because it seems like he could pretty much do anything in the show. I know, I know. I mean, it would be interesting, you know, to see him have a... Uh, I mean, I, I prefer characters that make flawed choices, you know? Uh, and I think Ben is sort of like that, where he's very... He's good, inten he's good intentions, but he always... He sort of is flawed has makes bad decisions a of lot course. of the time and so I would like to continue seeing Ben in those positions you know it might be interesting to see him in a relationship or something or um, you know or maybe see how he would handle success like if one of his crazy zany ideas actually worked and what that would mean to him and how he would handle that you know uh, it would be fun to kind of see all those things it does seem like he could go pretty much anywhere, but you could drop him into almost any situation. Yeah. See what happens. <laughs> I know. I think, I think, and that's, you know, part of the reason I love doing it is that he is so good and good, you know, free spirited and right. good. And like I said, he's good intentions. Like he's coming from the right place. You know, he's always, he's always trying to do the right thing. And he's <laughs> always like excited by things. He just, you know, sometimes it doesn't always work out, but... Right. At least it's a positivity that exists, you know. So. Well, the other thing I'd like to know is what what comes next. I mean, you're you've you you've done this directing. Yeah. Uh, you know, that's coming out next year. Yeah. What else interests you? What what's coming next? Um, I think just kind of continuing to do what I've been doing in in terms of acting. Like, hopefully, the show continues because I love doing it. Yeah. I would love to be able to act in in bigger movies you right. know and and um work with people that i've always dreamed about working with you know that would be who, who would that be any names that you can name drop for us no i mean yeah. i think every anybody that would be on your list is probably on my <laughs> list you know um so I, I would love the opportunity to take on bigger bigger roles in in movies you know most of the stuff i've done has been smaller so it'd be nice <laughs> to have a a bigger meteor something to do um and then continue to to work with jim you know who uh i love to work with and have a lot of fun doing that and and writing things that you know maybe we can be in or we're not in and 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 the directing was amazing and and something that i would like to continue to pursue as well so any chance we'd see you on community at some point no or? man i've been no. trying to tell jim get me on the goddamn show you guys can come in with your Oscars. I know, <laughs> I know. I, you know, I keep asking him to tell them to to write me in, but he doesn't. So, you know, we're gonna have a Next talk. Season. We're gonna have a sit down. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, absolutely. So nice to chat with you.